Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can mention multiple people at once using the text feature in Microsoft Teams. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So here I have a team, obviously in Microsoft Teams. And uh, the regular way to mention you know, people on my team would be to obviously use the at symbol and then um, you know, essentially whatever message you want to type. And this person will be obviously notified by email and various notifications. Now, let's say I want to notify multiple people at once. Uh, so I don't have a large team here, but let's pretend there are like 30 people here. And you know what, um, John and Mary, let's say they work for finance and uh, or maybe some other department. And uh, I want to uh, essentially address them uh, as such. Uh, I want to maybe um, send a message to all the finance uh, folks at once. So to do that, what you need to do is this. Um, in the team, you know, you obviously click Manage Team. This gets you to the screen, and you click the uh, Tags feature. Uh, I already have uh, set up uh, a tag for Finance, so let's create a new tag. Uh, let's say we have a tag for, uh, I don't know, um, uh, Business Analyst, all right? So we are going to uh, create a tag for business analysts, and we are going to add uh, Mary and John. All right, so here we go. And you click Create. So here we go. Uh, I have this tag, and I can obviously you know modify it at any point if I need to uh, add people, etc. But let me show you how this works. So when I uh, do the you know start the conversations, a conversation I use the add symbol, and I can just type in the uh, name of the tag and you see here we go it even tells me hey you you are starting to type a business analyst it contains john and mary so uh they will both be notified at once so it's a really great feature if you have multiple you know a really large team and maybe you have groups of people maybe management maybe finance business analysts and you want to essentially reach out to them uh kind of separately now by default tags can only be configured by team owners. Uh, but let me show you a way you can tweak that. So by default, you have to be uh, a team owner, essentially, to be able to uh, create new tags and modify them. But if you want to give this power to regular team members, just click on Settings, Tags, and you see by default, um, you know, essentially, tags are managed by uh, owners. We can switch it to owners and members. So this way, um, my, you know, regular team members can uh, uh, can also, uh, you know, manage the tags and add, uh, you know, add, add a delete, uh, you know, tags and, you know, people inside of those tags. So that's a nice little feature, very useful in my opinion. Uh, great, uh, could be a great time saver if you have, again, large teams. And this is all I wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you again. Uh, for watching uh, and have a great day. Bye-bye.